Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Jonah, your spiritual guide. Today, I'm going to reveal a deep secret for you for spirituality. Life is spiritual. Excuse me. The spiritual control the physical. You know, God is within us, is in us. And that is why he say that greater is he that is in you than the one that is in the world. Wake up. God is everywhere. God is not just in the building. God is, you carry God in you. But what you need to do, excuse me, <coughs> in this area, is to activate your power by acquiring spiritual knowledge. You can go far, excuse me, <coughs> if you did not acquire spiritual knowledge to set yourself free. And that is what the Bible says in the book of Hosea chapter 10. He said, my people are perishing because of lack of knowledge. And because they rejected knowledge, I, the Lord, will also reject them to minister before my presence. What kind of knowledge do you think God was talking about? Do you think God was talking about the Western education? Do you think God was talking about on how to speak English? Or French? Or Latin? No. God was talking about the spiritual knowledge. Because God is the spirit. Because God is the spirit. God is not a man. What would God do with the wisdom knowledge? What would God do with French, English? God is the spirit. And that is why he say that only those who worship him in true and in spirit can become his children. My brother, wake up. There is no time to check time. God has given us the natural things to use them to fulfill our destiny. God has given us the herbs to fight the enemies. Go to the book of Luke chapter 10 verse 19. He said, He said, I have given you the authority to trample upon snake and scorpion and to also overcome all the powers of the enemies and nothing but the enemies will hurt you. He said, I have given you. He didn't say, I will give you. There's a difference between I have given you with I will give you. He didn't say I will give you. He said I have given you the power. Meaning the power is in there. Or what you need is to activate the power by acquiring spiritual knowledge. God has given us the herbs to use them to fulfill our destiny, to break every curse, to set ourselves free. But we are crying in the midst of plenty. Mm. Are you with me? Now, I would like to teach you this prayer. A prayer of a relationship. If a woman or a man is into a relationship and you want to know if this relationship is the right one, this is the prayer you are going to do. But before I proceed, I would love to introduce some of my spiritual items. I supply a gila powder. I supply Abo Obo, the original one. The Abo Obo, the anti witchcraft powder. I supply a very strong, powerful solution for the moving object in the body, which is the black magic. The moving object in the body is a black magic spell. The moving object in the body is a voodoo power. These are the kind of sickness where when people go to the hospital and the doctor diagnoses them, he says nothing. He sees nothing and he tells them that they are okay, which they are not. My brother, my sister, wake up. With this solution, I give you seven days. It has healed people of five years, seven years, ten years of moving objects. 
I can send it to you anywhere you are. This stand is not a barrier. I can send it to you through DHL. I supply alligator pepe. I supply spellbreaker oil. Different spiritual product that fight against witchcraft. Black magic. Spiritual sickness. This is this other area where my core is focusing. Are you with me? You can never be healthy physically when you are not spiritually healthy. The first thing you have to do is for you to be spiritually healthy before you can be able to be physically healthy because it is the spiritual that controls the physical. Life is a program. It has to be programmed spiritually before manifesting physically. So we all have to wake up. We all have to wake up. There is no time to check time. Things are really happening. People are dying without fulfilling their destiny. People are sick. People are not. You can see someone, you know, you can see people with materials, with properties, money. But he's sick. How can you enjoy your properties? How can you enjoy your money when you are sick? You need to wake up. Wake up. I said, wake up. Don't give up. You are not alone. God is you. You, you that you are watching this video, I'm talking to you. You, God is with you. You are not alone. You can fight this battle. You can defeat the enemies. You, you can be healed again. You can wake up again. You can fight the enemy and take over that which belongs to you. You, you that you are watching this video. I am talking to you. The Spirit of God is talking to you. That you should not give up. There is no time. Don't. You can never give up. Because God has never given on you. So you will never give up. Wake up. If you're in need of any of my spiritual services, you can contact me. Plus 234-9014-969227. Excuse me. You can call me on WhatsApp or on video call. To be sure I'm doing you're speaking to. Because there are scammers everywhere. Are you to me? Remember this. Now, this prayer... It's for you to know if the relationship you are into is genuine. It saves you from bad and toxic relationship. It saves you from corrupt relationship. If the relationship you are into, you want to be sure if this, this relationship will taste the, the time, will taste the 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 the, 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 the we, we will survive do this get a soap a washing soap soap that you know that you used to wash clothes get that soap nature is god nature is power any kind of soap any type of soap you can use it a soap that you know that uh that is four corner like this you understand I'm sorry, that is uh, like a four corner, a soap, a big soap. Then hold it like this. Do this prayer. I call upon God Almighty to show me the right thing to do. To reveal that which is hidden. I call upon my guardian angel. To direct my paths. I call upon my ancestors from my father's side, from my mother's side, to show me what I need to see, to reveal to me what I need to know, and to guide my paths. And so shall it be. And so shall it be. And so shall it be. Three times. Then gather some of your clothes. Then start washing clothes. So I wash the clothes. On the process of, of washing that clothes, those clothes, and that soap break, it, that relationship will be a toxic one. 
I repeat, it means that relationship will be a toxic relationship. So come out of it. It's not going to be healthy for you. Are you with me? Mm. It's not going to be healthy. Come out of it. Mm. I think that is all. Um, if you are already married, and any time you use that soap, washing clothes, and the soap is breaking, it means your relationship will continue, your marriage will always be sour. Mm. Are you to me? Remember, this, if you love this video, I would like you to share, subscribe, and like. And God will bless you. May comment.